Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So today I have some units by Harlem125 and this one is from their Kima collection. It's a Kima lace wig and it's called KLW, Kima lace wig 06. I'm wearing her in the color 99J and guys, this one is in the style Brazilian twist medium. And before I even start this, like, Oh my god, this looks so natural. I absolutely love it. From the moment I took it out of the box and I saw the texture on this, the texture looks so, so natural. It has like a natural yaki texture with curls. You know, it looks like you did some type of twist to your natural hair and, you know, it came out like this. It looks so pretty. And guys, I did not finger comb this. All I did was this just to, you know, get it apart because sometimes when it comes in a box, it's really like clamp together so I just did this I didn't even shake it no nothing that's it and look at the volume the volume is so pretty I love this unit I really really do and I think I would have to use this as my go-to now and the color I really love as well it comes in other colors I'll make sure to leave a list of them in the description box so you can check it out and I'll leave a link to the website as well so if you want to purchase it the link will be there you can go click on it it will take you to the website and you can purchase from there this is what the stock card looks like by the way and the hair is heat safe up to 400 degrees so you can always add heat to it do not add heat to this Please do not, but it's heat safe up to 400 degrees. So in terms of the parting space, I did not tweeze it. All I did was add some powder and I did that on purpose because I didn't want it to look too fake. Like I didn't want that clean, clean part. But it's still good. Like the way it came straight out of the box, it was good. It wasn't too clustered, but you can always tweeze it if you want to. So I just added some powder to the part. It comes with a deep curved part. But yeah, I love this. I didn't have any shedding or any tangling obviously because I didn't run my fingers through it but sometimes even curly wigs even if you don't run your fingers through it when you shake it like little pieces of hairs fall out but I haven't had that from this I've been doing this and I don't think I see anything really so yeah um I think that's about it you guys in terms of the cap the cap I would say is between small to medium in size it fits pretty snug and you get two combs up front one at the back and the adjustable straps it's a regular cap construction and the lace on this is very soft it's not a Swiss lace but it's very soft so there's no irritation or anything like that and all I did when I got it was put it on cut the lace or you can do it you can cut the lace put it on and that's it you don't have to do anything to this like there's absolutely nothing you have to do to this unless you want to probably spray it with some oil free shine or something because it has like it has some luster to it it's not it doesn't look dry but it doesn't look that vibrant either so you may want to spray some like wig shine or something on this but Apart from that, it's really nice. I really like this. And even the back of it as well is like really full. I like this wig. Really, really like this wig. <laughs> but anyway, you guys, thank you so much for watching this review. If there's something that I forgot to mention, leave me a question in the comment section down below. I'll be sure to answer it as soon as possible. If you have a wig that you would like me to review, leave it in the comment section down below. I'll do it as soon as possible once we have it in stock. And yeah, don't forget like and subscribe. Follow us on Instagram at Wigtimes and I'll see you pretty soon. Bye-bye.